Understanding the Equation of Motion, a Beginner's Guide. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an exciting and fundamental concept in physics, the equation of motion. Whether you're a student, a budding scientist, or simply curious about how things move, you're in the right place. Equations of motion are crucial for understanding the movement of objects in our universe. So, let's unravel this topic together, making it as simple and engaging as possible. The equation of motion refers to a set of mathematical formulas used to describe the motion of an object. These equations allow us to predict the future position and velocity of an object based on its current state and the forces acting upon it. In physics, understanding motion is all about answering two key questions. Where is it going? And how fast will it get there? The equations of motion provide those answers. Before we dive deeper, let's clarify a few basic concepts. Position. Where is the object? Velocity. How fast is the object moving and in which direction? Acceleration. How quickly is the object's velocity changing? These three concepts are the building blocks for understanding motion. They help us describe an object's movement over time in a precise way. Now, let's focus on the three key equations of motion often used when the acceleration is constant. 1. V equals U plus at. 2. V is the final velocity. 3. U is the initial velocity. 4. A is the acceleration. 5. T is the time. 6. S equals oot plus 1 half at squared. 7. S is the displacement. 8. U, A, and T are as defined above. 9 v squared equals u squared plus 2 as 10. This equation relates the velocities, acceleration, and displacement without involving time. These equations are powerful tools for predicting an object's movement under the influence of constant acceleration. Understanding these equations is one thing, but applying them is where the real magic happens. Let's say you're throwing a ball or watching a car accelerate. By using these equations, you can predict how far the ball will go or how quickly the car will reach a certain speed. These applications are not just limited to classroom problems but are fundamental in designing vehicles, planning space missions, and even in sports science. Thank you for joining me in exploring the equations of motion. I hope this video has shed some light on how these fundamental principles govern much of the movement we observe and experience daily. Remember, physics is not just about learning equations. It's about understanding the forces and principles that shape our world. Keep exploring, stay curious, and until next time, happy learning.